What's good YouTube? It's your boy Bass Chico and I'm back with another reaction video. Now this video literally just dropped like I say an hour or two ago, I'm not sure, but I go on Twitter and I'll say about 14, 15 people tag me like yo react to this, react to this. Cause people know I'm like an OSN fan. Some of my Twitter followers know that you feel me. Yo, Chico reacted this OSN got a haircut. You know what I'm saying? So this is my first time watching this video. I was actually saving it, bro. I didn't want to watch it like without reacting to it the first time. I was like, you know, who's, this is going to be an OG reaction on the spot. You feel me? So if you guys enjoy this video, make sure to drop a like. Let's go for 2,000 likes. And without making y'all wait, let's get into this video, bro. Let's see what's up, man. OSN, what you got? It's time for the moment you've been waiting for. Duh. Bro, look. Look at his hair, bro. I know my hair be messed up sometimes, bro. But can somebody explain to me? I I don't know. I haven't been an OSN fan like since he started, you feel me? I just I started supporting him along the way. But can somebody explain why he doesn't get a haircut or why he never got one? Is it like his religion? Is it like uh, some with family? Like, why doesn't he get a haircut, bro? He's got money. Like, bro. Somebody explain to me in the comment section because I don't want to be ignorant. But I don't understand why he took so long to finally get a haircut. That's if this video is not clickbait. Because I don't know. <laughs> Look at his, his facial hair, bro. Oh, my God, ladies and gentlemen. I bet you thought this day would never come. Shit, I didn't know if this day would ever. I, I never thought this day would come. No bullshit. I know a lot of people didn't because it's crazy that a lot of people have told him about getting a haircut for so long, bro. And finally, I guess the day is here, bro. So, hey, if this is clickbait, bro, I'm going to be so fucking mad, bro. Let's see, bro. Recover today, ladies and gentlemen. I just finished doing my videos. Now I'm about to go meet up with my barber. Now, I had one barber that I thought I was going to do. I told him I was a YouTuber. He was supposed to come to my house. We were going to record it in my house. I was going to give him some promo. Everything was seeming lit. You know what I'm saying? I dropped a tweet on it. Everybody was like, oh, my God. You're about to fucking get it. Blah, 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 blah. And then the dude just fucking flaked out. I talked to him on the phone. He never called me back. Dude ass tweaking, boy. That's free promo. You a barber and a YouTuber with over 1 mil subs tells you come over. I'm a YouTuber. I'll give you a shout. I'll give you some free promo. And you don't show up? Nigga, I'm sending my girl. Nigga, go cut that nigga hair. Fuck is you talking about? Back the next day, never fucking call back. So I'm like, all right, fuck this dude. I'm not about to be trying hard to give this dude some extra promo. Fuck that dude. You know what I'm saying? So anyways, um, so that didn't work out. I guess he must have seen some pictures of my hair on Instagram, and he got fucking scared. <laughs> to be honest, I don't even really know 100%. Dude was scared for his clip. I want to get. Uh, I kind of want to go and get like that old D'Angelo Russell. There's a picture of it. I kind of want to do. He wants to get a haircut like D'Angelo Ross. Please don't do that. I, I want it'd be funny if he just cuts everything off, bro. Just go ball like right here, bro. That would be hilarious, dude. But I know that's not gonna happen. I'm already known. Do something like that, but I don't know if I can pull that off. I don't you know, but I want to do off, something no. more than just like just a nappy like fader or like taper. I mean, it, it, I don't can't remember what this card has been so long, but I want to do something other than just the fucking taper on the side. You know what I'm saying? Because I feel like y'all took that look over, and I'm tired of seeing people with that. I want something a little bit different. So yeah, I'm getting ready to go to the uh, barber shop right now. First, I have to go uh, wash my hair. Then after I do that, we're gonna head over there. My appointment is at five. 3.30, I don't have a lot of time. Let's get started. <laughs> oh, man. I can't believe I'm really getting my... Wow. wow, wow, wow. All right, y'all. Let's get started. Yeah, yeah, you need to watch show. that down here. All right, now, let me just I don't know if he's I'm just one watching. Of these people that suffers from what's called nigga hair. I don't have good hair. I, I don't know if this is like he's just watching it now because he's about to go get a haircut. But if that hair, bro, the way it's twisted, I don't think my man's be watching it like that. Maybe he watches it once or twice a week or a month i don't know but his hair is locked kind of because y'all said he was playing with it 
like the way that shit look, nah, bro. Ain't no way he washes it like every other day or whatever. He better wash his hair, bro. Put hell the whole bottle of shampoo, bro. Just put the whole your dig in your hair. Have that super hot fire curly hair that some of you fucking bastards are lucky that you have. I have this super dry ass. Low key, I got the same type of hair, but I get haircuts though. Right now, I just moved to a new area. So. Uh, this is the shit that I use. The only reason I use this brand oh, called Main is bro. If you, bro, those two bottles he got right there, my nigga, that's what you need, bro. My mama got that. All the black people on the chat, let me know if your mama got those two bottles in your house, bro. If you're black, if you're African-American or at least just African, bro, I don't know about white people, not to be racist or nothing. Please, I'm not racist. I love everybody, bro. As long as you're cool with me, I'm cool with you. You show me love, I show you love. But those two bottles, bro, I know almost, I've seen those two bottles in hella black households, bro. My mama got them bitches. Boy, I tell you. Because I saw Wiz Khalifa, he made like a video on it a long, long, long time ago, a few years ago, and I was like, shit, if Wiz Khalifa uses this, then I'm gonna use this, but he's probably even Wiz use uses it, bro. This is what it's called, uh, shampoo, uh, conditioner. For those of you guys that have nigga hair, but are still able to turn your shit into some curly, super hot fire, tweet me whatever products you need. I mean, whatever products you use, because I'm going to need the dishes. But I heard him tweet him. Had to stop writing you back. Too young for a fucking attachment. Hey, Boogie. I'm like a biker with swag. Zippers on my back. Hey, Boogie, always like says favorite rapper now. You put a knife in my back. Yeah, that's all he ever tweeted about. The last one. I make a hit every track. Every one I make, I say that I got one. Okay. Put the shampoo in. We actually don't need to leave this in. We can take this right out. Take this shit right out. Putting the X on the map. You miss your X and you still trying to find. Uh, I he not gonna get it all out, bro. He done already? Okay. Just took that out of my head. This is how I wish my hair always fell. This is did y'all see how fast he just did that? You mean tell me you put shampoo in your head and you rubbed it out so fast, bruh? Come on, son. Lit right here. My shit feels sexy as fuck right here. Ooh, this shit feels good, but I can't get it to stay fucking curly like I want it. But anyway, okay, now we're gonna put this, uh, Conditioner it, you know what I'm saying? We leave this in for a few minutes. Face on my rollie is black. I'ma flood it up whenever the time come. Most of my hoodies are black. I was trapping before I was a rapper. I got off my ass and I ran it up. That's some of my stash was a hundred bucks. Now under the mattress got hundred suck. Niggas need clashes to study us. I tell her don't front it, she back it up. These hundreds is lifting my mattress up. The wife and the daughter, she acting up. You niggas be fucking the package up. My jeans are mirror, I swag it up. I got the collection, I'm adding up. Flooded the bridge out in Avion. I want you to see where I'm coming from. Okay, so this is like going to be like the worst wrench job I can ever do on my Yeah, it is. Hair. It is the worst wrench job. Shower, that type of when I every time I put that shampoo, bro, I literally go in the shower, take off my clothes. Nah, I'm saying, hold on. Every time I put that shampoo he got when I used to clean my, my hair, like I'm with my that shampoo in my mom's house, I put it in my hair, nigga, take off my drawers, have my balls hanging, get in the shower. Wash it all out, bruh. Dripping all over. You got to make sure you get all that out. You do not want to leave that on your scalp, bro. You don't want to, dog. It's but I don't know. Fuck. Okay, Maybe. so now um, I'm going to put a little bit of this little new shit that I found from just watching some niggas YouTube videos. Yeah, I know I'm watching fucking YouTube videos to figure out how to get my hair soft. This is some, some shade butter or something. Oh, my mama, boy. YouTube got everything, bro. Just search it up, homie. To help my shit stay curly, I've used it a few times. I don't use it as much as I should, but usually I'm just rocking a hat. I'm not actually rocking my hair, but since the summer is here, um, it's about time for me to figure out what the fuck I'm doing with my hair. So yeah, I'm gonna put some of this shade. Better get some waves, boy. Head. Probably still got some soap and hand. I mean, and uh, moisturizer, and conditioner in my hair, but I don't give a fuck. Fuck it. Okay. So now I got this shit in my hair, I washed it, I shampooed it, conditioned it, did all of that. Okay, now I'm going to get dressed, and then I'm going to see you guys in the... Hold on. Hi, right, John, we in the web. Okay, um, the Never place mind. is like Never an hour away. Um, I only have like 30 minutes to get there, so I'm running behind schedule. But the good thing is we got a fucking AMG Mercedes, so it shouldn't take too long, so let's just get on the fucking road. All these horses in my car got me going fast. I just want to do the dash, put my pedal 83 to miles per hour. 84, 85, 80. I don't crash. One false move that could be my man is all these horses in the car got me going fast. I just want to do the dash with my pedal to the guy. Going so fast, I don't crash. One false 
I know he's not trying to hit a hundred just for a video. So this man decides to just stop a 99. Huh? Finally, let's see. Let's see the clickbait. I'm about to get this shit cut. Uh, I'm not finna go with the D'Angelo Russell. I got some other shit that I'm finna do, but I ain't gonna say nothing. I'm gonna just let y'all. Uh, I've waited so like long for this, bro. Hold so, on. Yeah, I see barbers. Hey, make sure y'all go. Y'all see? Y'all see the free promo right there that the other barber could have got? I see barbers. Make sure y'all go check him out on Instagram. You feel me? He a real one, G. He cut no always send hair, like, bro. Go rock with him, bro. If you got an Instagram, go check out his Instagram. <laughs> Oh, he's actually cutting it. Shit coming off. Gas key, gas key, gas. It's not clickbait. In September. Bro, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. It's not clickbait, guys. He's actually cutting it. Yo, I moved to Cali who would have thought? From Chicago, and you the first barber I went to. Like I ain't sat in nobody else's chair trying to find a barber. Shit, that's that shit's scary. Line, yeah, line <laughs> yeah, that shit's scary as fuck. One of my friends tried to go find us a barber, and dude, fuck this shit up. Push this shit all the way back. I'm like, yeah, I'm finna just let you go ahead and uh, experiment till we find. <laughs> Everybody on that other shit. My boy getting a taper? Ooh. That boy finna be out here pulling all the bitches. Well, he already pulled all the bitches, bro. I mean, Owen is a he's a beautiful man, handsome man. Just like every other person is beautiful and handsome. So I guess he he got a beautiful girlfriend, you know what I'm saying? Uh <laughs> Don't you call me by my government. You get kicked out, girl, and I ain't playing. Uh, this nigga Kyrie came over by me, and I said, what's good, Kyrie? And he Bro, this... Real quick, just like I was a fan type shit. And then he double took, and he was like, oh, shit. Right and then he knew who I was. And I he will always, bro, I feel like that's one of the stories OSN will always carry, bro. Now, when did... Imagine what would happen if LeBron James was to turn around and talk to OSN in the chat, bro. What do y'all think would happen, bro, if LeBron was to say what up to him, bro? He would go crazy, flip the fuck out, bro. I start tweaking out. I'm like, oh, shit, this nigga know who I am. What the fuck? I can't do that, bro. I be growing hair under here, bro. I be cutting that shit, bro. That, uh-uh, homie. That feel weird. I don't know if it's just me, but how, bro? He's at be tweaking, bro. Never could have trusted so in 30 million for I'm old. Black skin on the low. Jason K shot one be bold. Nigga run the fade. Uh. 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 Make most these people fade. Bitch run the fade. Nigga run the fade. Hey, yo. Yeah. Yeah. Been that bad. Yes. That way. The Russell way, the only way. Bruh. <laughs> the only way, the Russell way. Bro, no lie, on a scale of 1 to 10, even though he didn't cut off everything, I'll give that haircut an 8. Let me know in the comment section what y'all would rate the haircut. But that looks pretty clean. He needs to start getting a haircut like that, like every, more often, bruh. <laughs> That's a clean ass haircut, bruh. He got my pops jersey. You know what I'm saying? This shit, all right. This fucking late nigga finally got his shit cut. Oh, man, I can't remember the last time I got my shit cut. What y'all think? It's lit? Fuck you, me. That way? Fuck you, me. Now it's time to take this motherfucker to the ball. See what this motherfucker gonna do. <laughs> I tell you, boy, finally got his shit cut. That's a clean like haircut, bro. You need to get more get cuts like that every single like time, bro. If the haircut is fire, leave a like. If it's about goddamn time, your boy got his shit cut. Let's see if we can smash at least 25,000 likes. Let's try and break the internet with this goddamn video. I need 10 million for you, stupid ass. But anyways, that's going to do it for the uh, vlog and shit. So, yeah. Uh, 
It's time to go put this motherfucker to work. Russell Westbrook style. Fashion guy. You feel me? Yeah, yeah. That way. Ben's way. Let's niggas, <laughs> boy, niggas get a haircut and don't know how to act. Say goodbye, my nigga. Finally happened. Yeah, make sure y'all go check out his barber, bro. That he did hook him up, bro. I don't know what that's about. But hey, if you watched this video all the way to the end, thank you for watching. The link to the original video will be in the description, so make sure you go check it out and whatever, bro. But uh, if you guys want me to react to any videos, y'all see my Twitter right down here. Uh, follow me and tweet me videos y'all want me to react to, and I will react to them as soon as possible. We expanding the channel, you know what I'm saying? We got vlogs, IRLs, 2K vids, everything, bro. I want you guys to rock with me for me, not for one single thing, but for being a person that I am for everything I do, all right? So thank you so much to each and every one of you that support me and all the new subs. Welcome to the channel. I hope you guys enjoy the content. It's your boy, Base Chico, and I'm out, fam.